Hi, this is Tim Lewandowski, Pioneer Field Agronomist for North Central Nebraska. Today I'm here to talk about soybean flowering and pod set and pod protection. Did you know that a soybean plant can put on as many as 300 flowers over its reproductive life? During this early flower and pod set period, the plant will shed about 60 to 70 percent of its pods and flowers. This flower pod abortion is a natural occurrence as a plant monitors the amount of photosynthate available. So during these stages, we need to keep the plant very happy. Pod abortion can continue throughout the pond elongation and fill, with heat and moisture being the primary factor. Pod loss can also occur due to insect feeding on the early stages, during these stages. So during the R3 and R4 stage, which is pod set and pond elongation, as we see in this plant here today, we actually can have uh, insects like the Japanese beetle, grasshopper, um, soybean uh, leaf beetle etc they can damage the pods and stems so the pods will drop soybeans are amazing at their ability to compensate for the ability or increasing seed size and favorable late fill uh, conditions so from here to pod fill taking care of your soybeans with good water and late shot of uh, nitrogen it will help reward you with top end yields please check out the new pioneer a series uh, soybeans at a field day this august or contact your pioneer sales professional for more information that concludes this Pioneer Growing Point Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.